Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change the business portfolio name on Meta Business Suite. Before we start, hurry up and check out the yourself purchase under this video. So let's get started. So you might be wondering how to exactly update or change your business portfolio name. Well, changing or updating your business portfolio name is fairly easy. So first things first is you want to go to business.facebook.com and just log in into your account. Now, in here at the top left, you have the option to switch over to different business portfolios that you currently have on your account. So, what you need to do is you just need to click on the three, uh, sorry, the gear icon that you'll be seeing at the left, uh, the right side of that business, specific business portfolio. Like for some of this one, let's go and click on the gear icon. Now, from here, it's going to basically give you this option or the settings page for your business portfolio. So, whatever, let's click on the business here. Let's go ahead and confirm that. But yeah, so this is where you'll be able to see your settings. So what you need to do is we, you need to access the business portfolio info at the top left here, which is the very first one. And from here, you should see your business portfolio information. So what we need to do is you want to go to the very top here. You have the name itself, the portfolio ID, the primary page here. But at the rightmost side here, you have your edit button. Let's go and click on it. Now from here, you have your business name which in this case, in order for you to update that, you just need to type in whatever uh, information that you want to add here. Like for example, maybe I want to say uh, second or whatever uh, name you want to use for this one. And also you can have your primary page uh, as well here, page uh, Facebook page name or URL here as well. But let's go and click on save. And that should update our business portfolio name here, as you can see right now. Now, once you actually visit again the top left here, it should update itself, but you need to maybe reload your page here in order for changes to reflect. Let's go ahead and see. And it's now reflected. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.